Hi, it's Jay Carden, and let me ask you, are you having trouble with your warm market list? The people that you know, are you having trouble getting them into your business? Are you getting rejected a lot? Well, guys, listen, that is a common thing for most people. So what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to explain to you seven tips that can help you increase your results with your warm market list. So stay tuned. Okay, guys, so what are some tips for warm market? So let me share with you seven warm market tips that will help you get better results. Number one is you need to care less. And that doesn't mean you don't care about your business. It means you need to come off as you don't care if that person joins or not. That person is not necessarily going to make or break you. They need to get that impression that you're going to do it with or without them and that they are being done the favor, not you, okay? If they think, hey, I joined them, I helped them, no. They need to think, I joined them, it helps me. They need to see what is in it for them. So don't don't be all beggy and beggy and pushy because that's just going to drive them away. Um, you need to look professional need to look like, hey, I'm doing this with or without you. I'd love to have you, but, you know, if you're not interested, um, you know, no problem. I'll talk to you later. Thanks. You know, see you at Christmas. Um, the, uh, the next thing you need to do, um, always be in a hurry when you're prospecting them. Uh, you don't want to have them asking a lot of questions. What is it? How much does it cost? All those things. What you want to do is be in a hurry Get a meeting set, a time set to be on the phone or in person or meet for coffee, and give them the business presentation that you that your company offers, and let them watch that presentation. Especially if you're new, you want them to see the company's presentation, and then you sign them up. So be in a hurry when you first talk to them, when you're prospecting them, and avoid vomiting information and you know losing. Losing the deal. All right, ne next thing what you want to do, you think about this. You never never talk about it. And, of course, one of the biggest tips is to talk about your business. But what I mean by you never talk about it is once you tell them one time, don't be the person that just constantly talks about it every time your warm market's around. This isn't cold market. This is warm market. So you don't want them seeing you coming a mile away and then going hiding. So you just never talk about it, guys. That's the thing. You, you've mentioned to it, they know, and it'll be in the back of their head, and they may ask from time to time. That's a different story. But don't always be yapping about it, okay? You will drive them away. It's a turnoff. So bring it up one time, drop it. Also, what you need to do is you need to become a product of the product. Uh, different companies have different products, but... If they see you always using your product or they see you've gotten a result with your company's product, that's huge, guys. Uh, they need to see a life-changing benefit that you have had from that product. Now, that might not lead to builders all the time, but that could get you a few people wanting to try and buy and be customers of the product because they like what you're getting from it. Okay, you also want to... Um, uh, understand uh, on on tip. This is like the fifth tip. On you know, no really means not now. So if you've been told no, don't think that that's the end of the world, guys. Because no only means not now. Okay, remember that no means not now. You will be asking them again down the road. Okay, you will bring it up for them to have another shot at joining your business. Because remember, like I said in the beginning. It's not going to make or break you. You know, you're not begging them all the time. You look more professional and solid about your business. So they're need, they got to see that if they join you, that's a benefit for them, not for you. That's where a lot of people mistake in this, okay? They make that mistake. So become, I mean, uh, remember that no means not now, and you will be asking them again, so don't give up. Some of them will come back around. Trust me, they will. 
sooner or later. You also, uh, tip number six, you want to run through your list quickly, okay? Run through it as quick as you can because you don't want to ask Uncle Fred, you know, one day and then Aunt Susan, his sister, six months later when she's known about it for nearly six months because Uncle Fred told her, you know, hey, you know, so-and-so's doing a new business, okay? Run through that list quickly. Contact them within a couple of days. Everybody you know, within 48 hours, you should have contacted every single person you know because you want to move on to cold market recruiting as fast as possible. When you start recruiting cold market, warm market sees, hey, you're making money. Now you're making money. A lot of them will be changing their tune. Basically what this is is you're putting it in their brain now, and you're coming back later for the score. Okay, hardly anybody makes a sign-up on the first contact, guys. All right, last tip, number seven. Create a new warm market. Now let me explain. In other words, all the people in your warm market now, other than your family, you put them there. These are the people you chose to hang out with. These are the people you built a life around. And if they're negative-minded and they're not, you know, they're always insulting you, change your warm market, guys. Look for people in public places. Look for other entrepreneurs and people that have a success type of mind and build a good relationship with that person. Start, you know, talking and, and, and interacting and being good to people that, that you would like to have in your business. Start talking and building relationships with a new warm market and start surrounding yourself with positive people, and you'll get more of a response out of those. So guys, I hope you appreciate the seven warm marketing tips I shared today. And if you haven't yet, be sure you go to my website, jcarden.com, and sign up on the form to get free gifts, daily tips, and weekly mastermind trainings. Guys, this is the biggest giveaway, most valuable giveaway, absolutely free, out of all network marketing. So go to jcarden.com with the link below. Go check out the post and uh, get signed up for all this free value and training, guys. It will help you explode your business. So guys, thanks for watching. I enjoyed it, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye for now.